Okay, we have another question before us. The length of a cord 3 cm from the center of a cycle of radius 5 cm. We have to find the length of a cord 3 cm from the center of a cycle of radius 5 cm. Now we are given some options option A, 8 cm, option B, 5.6 cm, option C, 7 cm, and option D, 6.5 cm. So let's get down to business solution. Now uh, let's try to make a diagram for this. So let me make a little sketch of a cycle. Okay, so that should be a cycle. Then we have a center. We have a center. Now, uh, any line that runs from any uh, from the center of the cycle to any point on the circumference is a radius. So let's take this to this point. That's the radius. And of course, we know a chord. This is a chord. We have a chord there. Now, from this place to this place, the radius of the cycle was given to us as 5 cm. So let me try and write this 5 cm. Okay. So if this from here to here is the length of the chord. Now the distance from here to here, let's call this place A and let's call here B. So from A to B is the length of the chord. Now we already were told that the distance from the center of the cycle to the chord, that is the length, the length of a chord, 5 cm from center, that means the, the length, this chord length from the center is 3 cm, sorry, 3 cm. So the length of this chord, the distance of this chord from the center is 3 cm. So if you look at it, this, a right angle triangle, so we have this. Now, our chord is from year to year, from point A to point B. That is literally this line AB. Now, let's call from year to year. Let's call it X. Let's call it X. Let's call that X. Now, we can use right angle triangle the Pythagoras to solve this. You know that this is the hypotenuse, so that would be by Pythagoras, by Pythagoras theorem, that would be 5 square is equals to S square plus 3 square. That is 5 square plus equals to s square plus 3 square. So the sum, the square of the hypotenuse is equal to the square of the sum of the square of the other two sides. So let's uh, make our uh, x square the subject formula. Or let me just solve this. This would be 5, uh, 5 times 5 square is 25. That was 25 uh, minus 9 because this is 3 square is 9. So I'm moving to the side. I have minus 9 equals to x square. We now have that our x will be equals to square root of uh, because 25 minus 9 will give us 16. 16. So we have that. So by the time you solve that, our x is equals to 4. Now the distance from year to year is 4. This is also from year to year is also the radius. So which means this from year to year is also equals to from year to year because the radius from the radius from year to year is 5. Year to year is 5. So that means this length, this uh, chord, the length of the chord as requested, or the length of the chord as requested, is twice this line. That is from year to year, twice of it. So if from year to year is four, from year to year will equally be four. So can I say therefore, the length of uh, the chord. is equals to two times of line a b two times of line a b sorry two times of x rather so let me take this out two times of x two times of x so the chord a b length of the chord a b okay that is better now length of the chord a b is equals to two times of x and we already know that our x is four so that will be two times 4 and 2 times 4 is 8 and the unit was given to us in cm that is 8 cm so the correct answer is 8 cm so what we did was to uh, take this we find the distance here and since this line is equal to this line so that is to say twice of it and we got uh, 8 cm so that is the answer to that question the correct answer there is a correct answer is a which is here that's correct answer to that question.